Hello friends, Pastor Dave here. I wanted to talk about my wife Jackie. When I first met her, oh my goodness, 13, 14 years ago, uh, she would share with me, and I, and I say this very carefully because I don't want to throw anyone under the bus, um, but she would share with me how she felt like she couldn't be herself, how she felt kind of caged like a bird, and how she um, couldn't experience uh, who she was uh, in Christ. And when I met her, uh, she just didn't seem as confident as, as she should have been. Um, and so I would share with her things like, you know, I, I know who you are. I, I, I think she felt judged at times by some folks in her life. And she felt judged and she had to meet a certain criteria, their criteria. And I remember saying to her, in the, in the first several months that we were dating, I would say, honey, I, I know who you are. I know, I know exactly who you are. And I just want you to be yourself. In fact, one of the things I told her when, when we, we came into the pastoral ministry 10 years ago, when she was concerned about, well, what would they think of me and how should I act? I said, you just be the best Jackie God has called you to be. And you're going to be just fine. I want her to experience freedom in her life, to be who God had called her to be, not what anyone else thought she should be. And I couldn't help but think of Galatians chapter 5 and verse 1, Galatians 5, 1, where Paul writes, Stand fast, therefore, in the liberty by which Christ has made us free, and do not be entangled again with a yoke of bondage. Do you feel like you're not free today? Do you feel like uh, you're being judged all the time and, and that sort of thing? Do you feel like you're in bondage? Do you feel like uh, you just can't spread your wings uh, in Christ? I want to encourage you today to be everything God has called you to be. And don't let anyone or anything hold you back. Uh, don't think of yourself in a negative manner. Don't let anyone else uh, peg you in a negative way. Because God loves you and God is positive about you. And no matter what has gone wrong in your life or, or my life, uh, God has an answer. God has a way for each and every one of us. Every year I write a song for my wife for Christmas. And I was looking through some, uh, some, some uh, stuff in my, my, my computer, uh, files, that's the word. And I ran across something from 2011, which would be 10 years ago. And uh, I opened it up. And it's a song I wrote for my wife for Christmas on 2011. And uh, I hadn't sung the song in such a long time. I honestly, I forgot about the song. I feel so bad about that. And it's called Free. And it's all about the experience I just shared with you. So I like to sing the song in honor of my wife, Jackie, that she's experiencing freedom in Christ, freedom in our home, freedom in our marriage. And I wish the same freedom for you wherever you are, wherever you're at. And so I sing this for her. I sing this for you. I sing this for me, that we could be free in God. It goes like this. There was someone who tried to bring it down. But I know who you are. Yes, I know who you are. Take his lies and cast them to the ground. Let your life so shine. Shine like the stars. Free, it's the only way to be. Let Jesus speak through me. The truth will make you free. Free, it's the only way to live. For you and others, just forgive. It's your time to be free. Just for who you are This comes from my heart I'm speaking from my heart Leave the past 
past right where it belongs it's time to let it go you deserve much more free it's the only way to be let Jesus speak through me the truth will make you It's the only way to live For you and others just forgive It's your time to be free Free It's the only way to be Let Jesus speak through me The truth will make you free It's the only way to live For you and others just forgive It's your time to be free It's your time to be free It's your time